Good day, my friends. I'm the little comrade, and today I'm gonna show you my new solution for the world's biggest problem. And you know, I'm usually not someone who makes laws because I'm not a politician, but I have this great idea about a new law, and this law is gonna be called Paragraph 420 Blazed Faggot. And this paragraph will legalize gay marijuana, gay weed, yes, it will legalize gay weed around the world for everybody. And, you know, and, and for the peoples who are against it, I have a good solution. So all the people who are against it gonna be locked in the room with, with a lot of gays and and they gonna get 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 a fucking bong showed up their ass and the fucking guy is gonna be, t be 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 lighting the shit up and 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 take 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 smoke from the bong and the, the bong is gonna go into their ass and and they they gonna get weed in their ass and it's gonna be full of full of fucking dank and and all it's gonna be awesome so they gonna become also they they gonna like it I promise you. I know it's all genetically, so they're probably not gonna like it, and it's probably gonna be torture for them. So, uh, but but I don't care. <laughs> I think my 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 last solution for that is is pretty good because look, it, it's it's in a lot of Western countries, people are like, oh, we should we should illegalize it because or we should we should forbid it and not allow like Mariana or or gay marriage. And I say, well, look at that shit. It's it's not you who does that. Nobody's forcing you to do it. It's just some other people that, that have no consequences on your fucking life and your fucking family and your fucking job. So just by legalizing it, it's probably gonna have no effect on your fucking life. So why do you care? Or oh, you want to forbid someone else to do such? Do something, well, I call that some sort of fascism, and I don't like fascism. I don't like when people don't like something, and then because they don't like something, I don't want you to do it. You know, I mean, it's like, uh, I don't like smoking, so I think it should be forbidden to smoke for you at your home, at your private uh, private place. And this is kind of silly, you know what I mean? I, I, of course, I'm not gonna forbid you. Do smoke, I mean, do, do, do light up a cigarette, do it, or drink, drink, go drink some beer or, or, or any other alcohol or drink you like I'm not gonna forbid it because it's your private thing I mean I, I maybe I don't like I don't know green sofas you know what I mean I want my sofa being red you know what I mean and I'm not gonna go to your home and paint your your, your sofa red because it's yeah, uh, uh, green sofas are bad because I hate them and, and they should be forbidden because I hate it and I feel me offended but people are fucking offended by everything as I probably said and people care too much for other people. They care too much what is in other lives. Stop, stop. Just please give more fucks about everybody else's life. Uh, don't give fucks about everybody else's life. As long as it's not harming someone else's life. And as long as it's it's not damaging the other life. And and, and those people are adults. And they're, they, 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 they're adults. They need to be adults. They need to be was concerned about it or the person needs to be concerned if, if he takes drugs or if uh, those people want to marry you know what I mean and and I don't see any reason why it should be legal you know what I mean I can understand why like harder drugs need to be illegal because they're more addictive as shit but marijuana isn't very addictive it's it's really not like it's like medical research shows that it it all not the body doesn't take THC THC it's, it, it it puts it away out it puts it out of the body it doesn't like THC how can it get addicted from something that your body pushes away it doesn't want that fucking shit and you know then comes this this silly argument like um well we don't know we don't we don't have enough researches for Mariana we don't have enough knowledge about we need to do more researches before we can use it all about you know what there are there are so many medical stuff which we don't know how to work but we would still use it like for the simplest example look up the medicament propofol just look it up it's a, it's it's a medicament 
that is used in medicine, that is used to put people in, in sleep so people can do surgery. You know what I mean? It puts people, in, it, it injects into the veins, people fall asleep, and, and then they do the surgery, and nobody knows how this fucking thing works. Like, there are people who speculate, and, and scientists work, and do not, uh, do not know how exactly it works, the, the, the pathophysiological mechanism behind it. But they still don't know it. But it's still used. It, 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 has some, it has some negative side effects. Of course, it can lower the blood pressure. So so somebody needs to watch the patient while it gets surgery. But, but it's still used because it's really effective. And, like, we, we, we don't have... We don't, maybe don't know how exactly marijuana works. But we know it's not fucking dangerous. And, like... We also know how fucking butt sex works, and it's also not dangerous. <laughs> well, as long as you use a fucking condom, you know what I mean? Always protect yourself. That's all I can say. Like, protect yourself, watch yourself, don't do hot drugs. If you do drugs, don't overdo it. Time to time, everybody needs to relax. I myself, I drink sometimes also one or two vodka bottles, but just to add some stereotype in it. I, I usually don't drink alcohol. Maybe I drink, I'm not gonna tell you. You're fucking want too much information from me. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you learned something for today. At least you learned my opinion, and at least you learned it that I have an awesome idea about the llama. So good night. I like you all. The internet is awesome, and the Sidani.